Hi girlies! Welcome back to my channel. Excuse my crustiness. I've like literally, well, when I say I've just woken up, I woke up about 30 minutes ago to Alex calling me. I was like, are you joking? I could have slept for another 45 minutes, but I'm kind of glad I did wake up actually. This week I'm doing like a weekly vlog because I'm going back to Winchester for, it's currently the 16th of August and I'm going back until the 1st of September. I think I might come back earlier depending on, you know, whatever I feel like. I'm low key shitting myself. When I first moved in, I was shitting myself to move in and then when I went back with Alex I was nervous but I wasn't as nervous as the first time because I was going back with him and I knew I was going to be occupied basically every single day because I was going to be with him do you know what I mean but this time I'm going back on my own obviously my friends are there but I'm just like scared and I don't know why every time I go back to Winchester like when I was in halls as well and I like came home and then I went back I would just get so nervous. I don't know if anyone else gets like that when they have like a change of scenery. Even before going on holiday, I always get this like surge of nerves and anxiousness. I'm going back today. I'm very nervous. Also because I'm getting my second vaccine on Wednesday and I'm just scared about the side effects because obviously you guys know I've got emetophobia, but I'm just scared about the side effects. Even I didn't even get bad side effects from my first vaccine i'm just shitting myself about that too but it's just i had to kind of get it done then because there was no other time that i could really have it done like i didn't really want to come home just to get my vaccine it just seemed a bit silly to me so kind of all my plans for the week i don't i haven't really got anything planned i might go to the gym with jess and we're just going to be like chilling in the house i think it's just going to be me and jess for a few days in the house and then a few of my other housemates are coming back and then alex is currently on holiday and he is coming back to Winchester on Saturday or Sunday, I think, because he's moving into his house as well. So I'll be able to see him as well. I feel like this video is just going to be chill. I just want to do like a realistic week of my life, like living in a student house, like what it's really like. Because obviously I feel like on social media, you see people, you know, at uni, like fucking doing something fun every day, like going out, getting drunk, going clubbing. And this is just gonna be more realistic because I don't have anything planned. I don't think anything massively interesting is gonna happen this week. I'm gonna get ready, have a shower, eat. It's currently like quarter to 10. And then me and my mum are gonna go. I get ready, it's gonna be fine. Guys, it's gonna be fine. Tell me it's gonna be fine, I need to hear it. It's gonna be fine, isn't it? Okay, yeah, cool. to leave. Excuse my skin, it's from the anxious diarrhea last night, but I'm gonna go. Wish me luck, an hour and 30 minute drive, and I'll see you guys in Winchester. We are in Winchester, guys. Me and Jess have spent the whole day sorting the living room out, and it's still, it looks good, but it still needs work. We put these fairy lights up, and we sorted out the table, and we need to go just fucking sort it out. I'm gonna order some stuff, because we need a rug. We need a tablecloth. And we went and saw our friend Cam, who's just moved in down the road. That was so nice, wasn't it? Mm. Their house. I'm, of, I'm definitely going to vlog there because that's where Alex is living. But we were in there and we were just nosing around every single cupboard. We were like, oh, what's in here? What's in here? And also, because I said this morning that I was nervous about my vaccine, we have found a walk-in walk vaccine tomorrow that we're both going to go to. Now I feel less bad because if... I get bad side effects, hopefully Jess will too. I hope we don't die. We might, but if we, we die we'll together. die together, exactly. We'll go for it together, it'll be fine. I'm just hoping, because my eight week mark is on the Wednesday and it's Tuesday tomorrow. So we're just hoping that that won't be an issue. I don't see how it would be, but. If it is, I'm gonna be also, we found an old man and made him mow our lawn. <laughs> our neighbor, I'm not just some random old man. He mowed our lawn king a little bit scary but Good morning sexies i woke up about like 30 minutes ago i don't even know actually i slept so badly last night like you know when you're worried about something that's happening the next day and you just can't like properly fall into a deep sleep like i was so like awake asleep awake asleep awake asleep too hot too cold like not doing well i was just getting myself fucking stressed about my vaccine today like i'm literally so scared like i'm absolutely shitting myself it's really 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 nervous like i even had a nightmare about it so that's good but yeah i'm getting it done this morning hopefully at the cathedral because i've got a walk in i'm just so scared i don't even care about the pain i don't i didn't find the first one painful it's literally the side effect yeah i'm just i'm i'm nervous also my fucking tapestry keeps falling down so excuse that but 
yeah my fucking eye what is going on just want this to be over like once this is over once i know my side effects aren't going to be bad i'm going to be so calm but the last few days i've just been so anxious about this like last night i was literally so anxious like oh my god i was fucking sweating because i was getting so scared but yeah i'm gonna do it and we're gonna do it we're gonna be brave and it's gonna be okay and then i'm gonna be double vaccinated so it's all good but it's just doing it isn't it it's scary but i'm gonna start getting ready have a shower do my makeup probably actually do like make myself look cute because then at least i'll feel a bit better please pray for me because this is a big deal for me and i'm gonna be very proud of myself once i've done it because then i don't have to think about it ever again outside the walk-in absolutely drenched um, and we're the first ones there <laughs> very eager but that's what we love minutes. no but hopefully they'll start sooner because they'll see us here yeah. and they'll be like we'll do it now spotted are some local anti-vaxxers <laughs> creating a small documentary yeah. of the day should we just film sorry i'd be filming all my video just like in my bed but for some reason i just keep forgetting to film jess we're out i don't even want to film myself right now i actually look i look a state i am not thriving guys i thought last night i was like oh the vaccine it's not hit me i'm fine no i went to sleep and i literally had hot and cold flushes, my whole body was hurting, my ears were hurting, my head was hurting, my stomach was hurting because I was anxious already and I just could not fall asleep and it took me so long and I hardly slept last night and I, that means I haven't slept basically in two nights so we're thriving but no it was awful <laughs> like I was so anxious and I just felt so rough and um I would not recommend to a friend but woke up this morning at like quarter past nine. I just feel shit. Also, my skin is really breaking out, hence the spot cream. Um, I've had a shower though. I've eaten some breakfast. I've called my mum crying just because whenever I feel unwell, I just feel so fragile. Like I need to be with my family or be looked after, even though it's kind of like I'm, I'm kind of okay now. I just feel a bit... Ooh, icky and like my body just has been a little bit better after talking to my mom i would ideally like to be at home right now but you know what it's fine um i'm just chilling today i'm just watching films just gonna have a chill day and then i think me and jess are gonna go for like a nice walk tomorrow probably get a costa i ordered dinner tonight as well because i just can't be asked to cook and i've got food delivery tomorrow as well but yeah i'm sorry this vlog has like really not been that interesting but this is just a reality and currently i look like a toe so yeah this video has just been me looking like a toenail like i'm not even joking i think i filmed one clip where i actually look good i actually slept really well last night like i haven't really filmed much the last two days because obviously i got my vaccine and then that night was not cute and then yesterday i was just kind of like recovering from the anxiousness recovering from the side effects i was so tired because i hadn't slept probably in like two nights and me and just just chilled we went to tesco's and then we went on like a walk in the evening which was really nice and watched love island and i slept so well last night like so well and yeah i'm gonna try and vlog a bit more today i don't know what's been going on with my phone either something's been like going on it's been crashing and i haven't been able to film anything because my storage has been full which is weird because i literally have nothing on my phone i'm going to pick up some like speakers today for alex me jess and our friend bonnie and yeah it's like a 40 minute walk but like it's probably not going to be that long like google maps do be lying and then i've got my d food delivery coming at two because i just thought it'd be easier to order like my big food shop let's start getting ready in a little bit it's like half 10 we don't have to leave till like half 12 um so i'm gonna chill and then have a shower and eat do my makeup because i haven't done my makeup in a few days either so this vlog has just been like me start talking looking ugly but that's what you signed up for bitch we're walking to town and to get this fucking speaker that we've been roped into getting do we know how big it is no <laughs> are we gonna be able to carry it back no probably not but alex uh, you owe me <laughs> you owe me big time turning on your home computer to read the day's newspaper well it's not as far-fetched as it may seem in fact both local san francisco papers are investing a lot of money to guys we picked the speaker up this is why do i look obese why do i look <laughs> fucking red that is not a good angle <laughs> we picked the speaker up it looks shit but we're in like a rich area and we're just like 
Yeah. But no, we walked. It took like 40 yeah, minutes to walk here. Okay, so try it and see what it's like. Should I try connect to it? Yes. And then we'll take. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try connect. Okay. Just making some eggs. And my Tesco's order came. And why did I spend 30 quid on like seven things? Why is food shopping so expensive? Someone explain. But me and Jess got this tablecloth. Kind of cute. But we're trying to work out how to do this lamp. I'm gonna break it. Right, look at it. It's meant to be like out. Surely it's not meant to be like that. We it can't to seem to work it out. Thing. We're not adults, guys. And also, this is the speaker that we went and got. And um, is it worth 25 pounds? I don't know. Oh my god, guys, I'm not doing well. <laughs> I'm cooking onions, but look at my face. <laughs> oh my god. They are streaming <laughs> because of the onions. Try and get the service just like that started. Science editor Steve New Me and Jess have just been watching Love Island and we were watching fucking Naked Attraction because it was like the only thing on. But my room is looking so cute. And I finally managed to get my tapestries to fucking stick up. But I've ordered some more um Kamal strips so I can continue sticking my pitch socks, my photo wall. It's so nearly done. It's just not quite done, but that's my husband right there. Sorry this video. I'm sorry. I've just kind of been filming in my room this vlog. I've just really not been feeling the most amazing. Like, I've been feeling quite insecure this week about my skin, about my appearance and my body. I'm just feeling a bit yucky. A little update, guys. Also, it's my birthday a month today and I'm turning 20, so that's really scary. Please pray for me. I don't want to be 20. I don't want to be an adult. I'm scared to edit this video as well. I feel like it's literally so boring. It's literally just me being like... I'm in my room, I'm doing this, I'm doing that, but now she's showing you what I'm doing. I'm trying to get better at this, but anyway, I'm still rambling, but night, see you tomorrow. Friday check. I am literally feeling so insecure. Like, I look so bad, guys. Me and Jess are going for a little walk. We're gonna go to Costa, just go for a little stroll. We've got our Costa. I look so <laughs> I look so oh gross. We were gonna get cake, but there was a fucking fly landing on all the food, so. We decided against that, but how's your drink? I don't know. It tastes weird. We're just trying to find a shortcut back. But because we were going on a nice walk, but it's literally going to piss it down. So I've literally had the most chill day. Like, all I've done today is walk to Costa with Jess and then go for like a little walk. And then Jess has gone home for the weekend because she's working. And it's just me and Daisy. And I think Daisy's boyfriend's coming. She's just going to go get him from the station. But I'm just making dinner i spent my afternoon making my dinner i made frankfurt pasta from scratch we love to see it and i just did a workout had a massive call with my mum because i've just been feeling a bit shit this week yeah i just had a shower now i'm just having my dinner because i've not really eaten much so i'm really hungry i'm getting really bad cramps stupid pill <laughs> Honestly, hate being a girl. I'm gonna end this video here. It's Saturday and I've just been out with two of my friends, which has been really fun. I'm gonna end the video here because I need to edit it and upload it for tomorrow. But I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, comment, subscribe, all of that. I know this hasn't been like the most interesting week at uni. There'll definitely be more interesting ones when more people are here and stuff. But quite a hard week, to be honest, like with the vaccine, just been having some personal stress, but a realistic look into life of living alone it's also been stressful because loads of the stuff in our fucking kitchen's broken the uh freezer's broken so we're trying to shove all of our stuff into one freezer this is the stuff you don't know about living in a student house you have to sort maintenance stuff out which fuck i can't be fucking bothered i can't i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you all next sunday with another new video bye